So I got myself my next rat rod project here. 31 Chevy. Four door. Pretty decent shape. Couple bullet holes here and there, which is pretty cool. The body itself is really clean, no rust through. Figured it was a great start for a rat rod. The motor is seized up. Uh, most of the parts aren't here, so I figured eh, it's not really worth restoring it. Uh, the wood is also rotten inside the doors, and for it to be restored to original will be more than it's ever going to be worth. So for me, I want to build a rat rod out of it. Uh, I don't really care if people are going to hate on it. That's just how it goes. That's what I want, so it's better than doing nothing with it. Needs new floors. Um, I'm going to end up doing some pretty wild things to it, so that's the least of my worries right now. <laughs> And this actually has parallel leaf springs in the front. Uh, a lot of the 30s Fords actually have the, the leaf spring that goes over the top. <clears throat> but this is parallel. Makes things a little more difficult. Uh, this is actually almost nearly impossible to find parts for, which is another reason I'm not restoring it. Um, every, all the springs would have to be custom made if I wanted to replace these. And for what I'm doing, I'm going to have to have some heavy springs. So I'm going to end up going with a 30s Ford front, front end. Um, I'm actually going to do airbags, four link, uh, that kind of stuff. they pretty cool. Going to run fenderless, so if anybody's interested in the fenders, I'll be selling those. Uh, price to, do, to be determined at this point. Also probably be selling the bumpers and whatever. Whatever else I don't use. Um, that'll probably be in about six months here. But shoot me a message if you're interested in anything. Uh, mostly only going to use the body and the frame. Pretty much everything else is kind of for sale. Stay tuned. I'm going to do some wild stuff with the motor. Um, do a lot of custom stuff, a lot of rat rod things that are going to be pretty damn awesome. I'm hoping this one gets as much publicity, if not more, than my uh, bag C10. Thanks, and enjoy the video, guys.